Okay, I wonder if you all know what Bobesh is. Bobesh is, are these little decorative coloring that catches the wax from the candle and often on the candelabra they have these crystals which makes it very elegant. Now the accent decor, a lot of the candelabra come with it uh, or you can purchase it with it or on it or you can buy it separately in case you break some or you lose some. So really you can buy these by themselves as well. So here we go. This is a bobesh. This is the bobesh. And so what, can, what else can we do? I and mean, we're always looking for different things that you can do that, that again in, interchanges with, with the, the different items, different product. But I thought it would be really fun to use these on these fat uh, vases because it has a nice solid thick um, uh, rim onto which you could then place this. Now if you're a little bit worried about it staying in place, you could always put uh, your glue dash so that it stays firmly in place, but really when you design flowers into it, you'll find that it all stays in place because the stems just goes right into it. So using that as a collar, you can then place your flower like so, and in this case you really don't need a whole lot and you really don't want to make it too much because you want to preserve the beauty of that glass mobesh. So maybe a couple of flowers like that, maybe a couple of lisianthus blossoms, and, and you're really simply done. I think with this particular arrangement, what you want to do is do it in, in, in components. You want to do it in multiples. So you want to do two or three or groupings, and so that here we have the taller ones, you can do a smaller one, and in this, I'll also attach a little bit of the fair grass to go with the other so that it sort of complements the flow to the other direction. So it could be something like this. Now, in that collar, these are actually bigger bobesh here. It's, it's a little wider collar. And so what I did was I used a little bit of water cubes around it so that it had, surrounds with a with, um, little bit of that sort of crystal look. And then into it, you could still then design a few other flowers into it, like carnations could just rest right in that little pl uh, platter. And so that works very well. So you can do, you, uh, use that combination as well. But it, I think it makes for a very, very beautiful, elegant uh, setting in groupings. Maybe even underneath this, around this, you have more crystals so that you can be quite elegant by doing something up here and then something down below. But the latest discovery, which is really, really neat, is as I was working on this, preparing for this, it just so happens that the Josie vase was sitting next to it. And I thought, wow, look at this. Look, because I saw how it's, um, how it's sort of funneled like that and how that would fit just absolutely perfect. And what a beautiful candelabra that becomes. And the candle just sits on top. Now you can fill this with color if you like, or you can do little arrangement because these have opening on the side. These are actual vases, so you can have a little bit of flowers on the side or grasses that go flow from one to the other. I mean, it's just endless, so think about that too.